I'm Ariana Mack reporting for WHKY News. The United Arts Council of Catawba County offers numerous opportunities for artists to further their work through grants and scholarships. Let's see what we can find out. Hello, I'm Tanja Smith, a local artist from Morgan, North Carolina, and a recipient of the United Artists Council grant in literature. And explain your book and your overall art style. Okay. Part of this show is about our book, The Adventures of Bailey Bleeker and Banjo, Linville Gorge. There's 22 paintings, um, original oil, uh, acrylic paintings. And then I also have other art, local, the mountains and New York City at the skyscrapers, where the title comes from. And I consider my work to be um, narrative, impressionistic realism. I work in oils and acrylics. Of course. And how did it help your art specifically? This has allowed us to um, do a third book. My daughter, no, <clears throat> excuse me, my daughter co-wrote the first book with us. The second book, she'll be, oh, excuse me, the third book she'll be writing herself. And I'm doing the illustration, illustrations for this third book from the grant. Hi, I'm Claire Pope. I'm an art program coordinator and associate art professor at Lenore Ryan University. I'm a local artist here and a grant recipient from the United Arts Council of Catawba County. And explain the Meadow Project and your overall art. Sure. Um, the Meadow Project was a one-year-long art project, um, an environmental art project, in conjunction with the Foothills Conservancy of North Carolina. And basically, I set a solar-powered camera, time-lapse camera, in a field outside of Morganton for one year. And that camera was set to document the regrowth of a field that was previously damaged by agricultural overuse. So every 10 minutes, a photograph was taken for a year. And through that process, we were able to um, uh, document the regrowth and for me a matter of hope for environmental regrowth at large. Of course and what does it mean to you to receive this grant from United Arts Council? This grant allowed the project to happen. I would not have been able to purchase the solar powered camera without the grant um, so I'm so very thankful to the United Arts Council. And for the viewers watching where can we find your art? Um, www.clairelpope.com and I'm currently um, just starting a new project entitled the Brownfield Project in association with the Industrial Commons um, so you can follow that project uh, for a year to two years beginning now. And why would you encourage other artists to apply? I encourage all artists to apply because um, uh, Art projects are meaningful and they need to be supported um, and that support can be invaluable in um, making your dreams and your visions come to life. Feel free to stop by the United Arts Council office during business hours to view Claire and Tanja's work. For more information on the United Arts Council, go to artscatawba.com. I'm Ariana Mack reporting for WHKY News. Back to you, Ralph.